Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at our quiz problem here. So we're asked to graph the function, and we have this function f of x equals x squared plus 3. So we want to get a graph of this function, and if you haven't tried the problem, maybe you want to go ahead and pause it and try it now. Pause the video. Oh, right, so let's take a look at our solution. Now, once again, there's a couple different ways you can approach this problem. I think from a math teacher's perspective, uh, what I'm looking for is just, just you have a basic sense to how to uh, how to find the basic shape of this function, okay? And you know how to kind of look at it and, and see some characteristics of the function. So, um, like I said, if you did this differently but still got the same basic graph, you know that's what I'm looking for. All right. So this is a function. It happens to be what we call a quadratic function, okay? And then this this quiz, by the way, is probably geared towards somebody um, at least an algebra one, probably more like an algebra two. All right, so this is a quadratic function, meaning that it's a polynomial to the second power, okay? And hopefully you know that these polynomials, or these quadratic equations, um, take the shape of a parabola, which is a U-shape type of uh, graph. So a basic parabola is going to start off, okay, if we just had the function f of x equals x squared, if you were to graph that, it's just going to be a basic graph a basic parabola is kind of going through the, the origin, okay, the point zero, zero. But in this case, what's happening is we have this basic graph, but we have plus three. So we have the basic parabola, but we have plus three. And what that's going to do is translate or move up our parabola three units on the y-axis, okay? So this is really kind of the graph that you're going to end up with. And, of course, I'm just kind of sketching these things out. But uh, I think the main point here, so this is actually our basic sketch, kind of our answer. So if you got something close to this, I think uh, most importantly, you have the point uh, zero 03 as your vertex, then that's good. Okay, that means that you can kind of recognize um, different functions, and this is a quadratic function. And, and uh, when you're looking at the function, what effects um, these different numbers are having on its graph. All right, so with more experience, you'll get better at this as you learn more and more functions. But uh, hopefully, um, this helps you out. Okay, you learn something. And of course, if you want to take more math quizzes, and especially if you're a homeschooler, you want to come on over to homeschoolmathquiz.com and have a great day.